Im imagine stepping into a world where nature reigns supreme. Welcome to the vast plains of Maasai Mara, Kenya, a land that stretches out as far as the eye can see, teeming with life in its most raw and untamed form. The Maasai Mara, an area of preserved savanna wilderness in southwestern Kenya, is a canvas painted with the rich hues of nature's grandeur. This is a place where the rhythm of life beats to the drum of the wild. It's here that you'll find an abundance of wildlife in their natural habitat, a spectacle that is both humbling and awe-inspiring. From the majestic lions, their manes catching the golden sunlight, to the graceful gazelles darting across the plains with a balletic grace, the Maasai Mara is a testament to the diversity and beauty of the animal kingdom. But the spectacle doesn't end there. As the day draws to a close, the sun sets painting the sky with an array of colors, each more vibrant than the last. The Maasai Mara is renowned for its breathtaking sunsets, a spectacle that fills the sky with hues of orange, pink, and purple, casting a warm glow over the expansive plains. The best times to visit this natural paradise are during the dry season, from late June to October. It is during these months that you'll witness one of the most spectacular wildlife viewing experiences on the planet, the Great Migration. This annual event sees over a million wildebeest, zebras, and antelopes traverse the plains in a grand spectacle of life and survival. It's a sight that is both exhilarating and humbling, a testament to the unyielding cycle of life that plays out on these vast plains. The Maasai Mara is not just a destination, but an experience that stirs the soul and sparks the imagination, a place where the wild and the beautiful coexist in perfect harmony. The Maasai Mara's untamed wilderness promises an adventure that stirs the soul, making it an unforgettable travel destination. As you stand on the plains, with the wind whispering ancient tales in your ear, you'll understand why the Maasai Mara is a place that truly must be seen to be believed. Beyond the wildlife, Maasai Mara is home to the Maasai people, a community with deeply rooted traditions and a culture that's as vibrant as the landscapes themselves. The Maasai, known for their distinctive red attire and intricate beadwork, have a rich culture that has withstood the test of time, maintaining their traditional ways of life amidst the rapid modernization of the world around them. Their culture is a captivating tapestry woven with colorful threads of rituals, practices, and beliefs. Central to their identity is their clothing, notably the shuka, a brightly colored cloth often red in color, wrapped around the body in varying styles. Their bodies are adorned with intricate beadwork, each piece a testament to their artistry and a reflection of their societal roles and age groups. And then there's the mesmerizing Maasai dance, the adumu, or jumping dance. A test of strength and endurance, young Maasai men leap into the air to the rhythm of their people's songs, their jumps reaching impressive heights. This dance, a rite of passage for young warriors, is a sight to behold and a testament to the Maasai's deep respect for ritual and tradition. But the Maasai aren't just about vibrant clothes and high jumps, they are also renowned for their harmonious coexistence with wildlife. This symbiotic relationship with the land and its creatures is a cornerstone of their way of life, with their pastoral lifestyle allowing them to live in tune with the rhythm of the wilderness. For travelers seeking a deeper understanding of this fascinating culture, there's the opportunity to interact with the Maasai during cultural visits. These visits offer a chance to witness their daily routines, participate in their traditional dances, and listen to their captivating stories, providing an invaluable insight into their unique way of life. Immersing oneself in the Maasai culture is an enriching experience that adds depth to any visit to Maasai Mara. A trip to Maasai Mara would be incomplete without embarking on a safari, an experience that brings you face to face with Africa's Big Five. Now, when we talk about safaris, we're not just talking about one type. There's a whole spectrum of safari experiences waiting for you in Maasai Mara, each one unique in its own way. First, you have your traditional game drives. These are your classic safaris, where you hop in a jeep and traverse the vast savanna, guided by expert rangers who can spot a lion's tail swishing in the tall grass from a mile away. But if you're up for something a bit more adventurous, why not try a walking safari? Yes, you heard that right. A walking safari. This is where you, under the watchful eyes of armed guards and experienced guides, get to walk on the same ground as elephants and gazelles. It's an exhilarating experience, to say the least. And then for those looking for a bird's eye view, there's the hot air balloon safari. Imagine floating above the plains at sunrise, watching as the savanna comes to life beneath you. 
It's a site you won't soon forget. Regardless of the type of safari you choose, one thing remains constant. The thrill of spotting the big five. The lion, leopard, rhinoceros, elephant, and Cape buffalo. Each one a symbol of the wild beauty and power of Africa. And let's not forget about the spectacle of the Great Migration, where over a million wildebeest and zebras traverse the plains in a continuous cycle of life and death. But remember, a safari is not just about seeing animals. It's about immersing yourself in the wild, feeling the pulse of the African bush, and understanding the intricate balance of life here. It's about respecting the wildlife, the environment, and the local communities who call this place home. A safari in Maasai Mara is not just a wildlife viewing experience, it's a journey into the heart of the wild. After a day of adventure, unwind in the comfort of luxury safari lodges and indulge in the flavors of Kenyan cuisine. Maasai Mara offers a broad spectrum of accommodations to cater to every traveler's taste and budget. Luxurious lodges, such as the iconic Mara Serena Safari Lodge or the intimate Olare Mara Kempinski, provide the perfect blend of comfort and authenticity. These lodges offer stunning views of the vast plains and an unrivaled proximity to nature, all while ensuring you don't compromise on comfort. For those seeking a more immersive experience, tented camps like the Governor's Camp or the Mara Intrepid's Camp offer the thrill of the wild with a touch of luxury. Imagine falling asleep to the distant roar of a lion or waking up to the gentle chirping of birds right outside your tent. It's all part of the enchanting allure of Maasai Mara. On the other end of the spectrum, budget-friendly options like the Ol Moran Tented Camp or the Mara Sedai Camp offer a more down-to-earth experience. These cozy, comfortable camps are perfect for those who prefer a more rustic, adventurous stay. After a day of wildlife spotting, there's nothing quite like indulging in the rich, hearty flavors of Kenyan cuisine. One must-try dish is Nyama Choma, a traditional Kenyan barbecue usually made with goat meat. Roasted over an open flame, it's a carnivore's delight. Equally popular is ugali, a cornmeal staple that's served with virtually every meal. Dense and filling, it's often paired with sukuma wiki, a collard greens dish, or enjoyed with a flavorful stew. And let's not forget about mandazi, a sweet donut-like snack that's perfect for a quick bite in between safari drives. For the more adventurous eaters, why not try some traditional Maasai fare like raw blood mixed with milk? It might sound intimidating, but it's a unique culinary experience that's deeply rooted in Maasai culture. Comfortable accommodations and delicious local cuisine perfectly round off the Maasai Mara experience. As we explore Maasai Mara, it's crucial to remember the importance of responsible travel. Venturing into this awe-inspiring wilderness, we are not merely spectators, but active participants in a delicate ecological balance. Responsible travel is a three-pronged approach. It starts with respecting local cultures. The Maasai people, with their rich traditions and vibrant lifestyle, are an integral part of the Maasai Mara experience. Be mindful of their customs, ask for permission before taking photographs, and always interact with respect and dignity. The second principle of responsible travel is minimizing environmental impact. Maasai Mara is a sanctuary for countless species. It's our duty to ensure that our presence doesn't disturb the natural order. Stick to designated paths, dispose of waste properly, and avoid using plastic. Remember, every small step counts in preserving this beautiful ecosystem. The final pillar of responsible travel is supporting local economies. Purchasing handicrafts from local artisans, dining at local eateries, and opting for locally owned accommodations are all ways to contribute. This not only provides direct economic benefits to the community, but also encourages the preservation of local traditions. Maasai Mara is at the forefront of conservation efforts, with numerous initiatives aimed at protecting its diverse wildlife. As visitors, we can play a part too, participate in volunteer programs, donate to conservation projects, or simply educate yourself and others about the importance of these efforts. In the heart of the African savanna, every action we take has an impact. Let's make sure it's a positive one. Traveling responsibly ensures that the magic of Maasai Mara is preserved for generations to come. Our journey into this enchanting wilderness is not just about witnessing its beauty today, but about ensuring its survival tomorrow.